Um, hi. Um, I've been diagnosed, I have autism, Asperger's Syndrome. So there was an autistic radio station once in the UK, so I've been listening to their shows. I listened to their live broadcast, and they very much hyped to have over 1,000 viewers, to 2,000 viewers, on their live on the on the live feed. I was wondering how the hell in heck did they manage to get that many viewers for a live radio show? Um how many people actually bother to listen to radio live now in the first place? And what really, really annoys me about the autistic radio station is it plays music. Um why do they have to play music on, on the station? Why do they have to why can't they just drop the music from the station and come and talk radio station? There was a very revolutionary talk radio station, um, but also based, based in the UK called Talk Radio. Then it changed its name to Talk Sport, and then only talked about sport on, uh, 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 on it. Um, so as they decided to drop their music and come more talk based, based, also the idea they started to go off the air and then play back to back music for absolutely hours. Then go on there for one hour with one interview or one guest or one show and then go off. So I'm not been listening to the live broadcast very much, so I decided to listen to the archives. The archives you can down you can download their shows on the archives and just listen listen to the archives. They nicely cut the music out for you. So it actually comes to about forty two minutes for an hour or so. So they um they play almost twenty minutes of music then. Uh, um, okay, um, so I am asked, um, what's the radio station and what's all the centers have to have one thing in common? They all have to be autistic. Or have asked, uh, there's many forms of autism and if you look up on YouTube and look up on the internet, you will find out many different styles of autism. I'm in diagnosis with autism and I've got Asperger's syndrome. I nicely spell it at the top for the people, the, the people who, who don't know what it is. They can look it up. Um, people who have that version of um, autism seem to have higher communications and can decently talk. I can certainly talk to a camera for the simple reason if I say anything wrong, I can go and address it again. I wish I had that in real life for the simple reason I constantly say something stupid or say something naff or say something I didn't mean or say something that hurt someone's feelings and didn't actually realise that. And the idea of the autistic radio station is also why it's an interesting idea. As they insisted on pre-tape, where they pre-taped the cells and actually put the cells